three couples will be battling it out in the Strictly Come Dancing final this weekend. The finalists vying for the Glitter Ball trophy are Rose Ailing Ellis and Giovanni Pernice, AJ Adudo and Kai Widrington and John Wade and Johannes Radab. Ahead of the all-important final, professional dancer Gary Edwards revealed he thought Bake Off star John may have peaked already. John, 32, and Johannes, 34, have made strictly history by becoming the show's first same-sex male couple. They have continued to impress the judging panel with their energetic routines over the past few months and have been praised by viewers for their ability to switch roles on the dance floor seamlessly. However, the Bake Off star landed himself in the dreaded dance-off during last week's semi-final with CBBC presenter Reese Stevenson. While John was saved by the judges, Dancing with the Stars expert Gary has explained why he believes the baker won't take home the Glitter Ball trophy. Speaking exclusively to Express.co.uk about the Strictly final, Gary explained, You've got the ones who'd have been really consistent and the ones who have been really up and down, and you've got the ones who have gradually improved over time. Right in the beginning, I was a huge fan of John and Joe Hannison surprisingly for me, I actually sat back and watched the semi-final dance-off and I would have put Reese through. He said he watched the dance-off three times and thought Reese performed far better than John. Gary said, I am a huge fan of John, but I thought his performance in the semi-final was heavy and I didn't like his timing and his weight was in the wrong places. He thought the judges were incredibly kind by saving John and Johannes and explained he disagreed with their comments. Gary added, I think some dances suit different people and I thought that Reese nailed the samba and got everything right. He danced it incredibly well and he had rhythm and that rhythm is not easy to teach. And I actually thought the opposite of John as I thought he looked stompy and heavy and his weight wasn't in the right place. Up until now I would have said John and Johannes would be in the final every week, but in that dance-off, I would have given it to Rees. Gary also said he didn't think John was leading Johannes like the judges thought he was, but he did credit Johannes for being an amazing dancer. Discussing who will miss out on the crown, Gary explained, AJ is definitely on the ascendancy, and I think John and Johannes have basically peaked already, and I think it will be challenging for them personally. It's a real shame as I was hoping they could win this year. But I think Rose will probably get it due to consistency as she can put on great performances. AJ will either have an amazingly fantastic performance or it's going to be, ouch. I think everyone is so mentally in the right place now, and I really hope that John hasn't peaked.